how to create a landing page for beginners so guys in this video i'm going to show you how you can create a landing page which gets conversion okay so i'm going to lay down all the steps which you need to create a landing page and also i'm going to show you the best the cheapest way on how you could create a landing page okay so guys first step is i would suggest sign up for bluehost okay so if you sign there's a link down below on the video if you sign up from that link you'll get a discount you'll get it for around 295 per month okay again just go with bluehost don't go with any other web hosting services the reason for that is bluehost supports you know affiliate marketing there's a chat support system and the uptime is perfect it and then also the website speed is really good the servers are up always so first thing is sign up with bluehost okay there are other page builders as well like click funnels but it's very expensive as you could see over here where does it say yeah so again 9297 per month or 97 dollars per month there's a 14 day free trial but again after that it's expensive there's builder all there's unbounce okay so these are the ones which a lot of people use but trust me i used to use click funnels but then i switched to the plain old basic web hosting by wordpress again it just cost 2.95 dollars per month hardly any you know it's just cheap okay once you so it's cheap and once you just sign up with bluehost the next step is all you have to do is once you sign up with bluehost so this is my website i've created you can create a lot of websites once you do this just go on limitless customization okay once you do that again i'm just doing a test one two three okay and next okay i'll just create on yawar khan just click next and don't install any of these things next and that's it guys your website would be launched so again once you create your website this would be your website again if you just visit site so this is your website this is how it looks now we are trying we will create a landing page and guess what guys when you sign up with bluehost they give you a free domain as well for the first year so bluehost.com just click the link down below so this is your website first thing all you have to do is just click go on plugins okay once you're in plugins delete everything the reason for that is you want your website to be as fast as possible so you don't want all these bullshit so just delete everything once everything is deleted and then what you have to do is click on settings and then click on permalinks once you're in permalinks just click on post name the reason for this is again you want your site name to say like when you create a page it will say like you know whatever your domain is slash whatever your page name is so just save changes so once that's done click on appearance theme so we are going to install a new theme this looks very weird um just go on add new uh and then you just need to type astra again it's a free theme so this one just install the next thing which you need to do is just go on plugins add new and just type elementor so this is it so just go back elementor and just install now once this is installed so this is done now next thing is we we will just go to clickbank and again when you go on clickbank okay so let's say we are going to create a page for this so this is how it looks so all you have to do is just click on pages click on add new and let's call it ancient Japan japanese tonic just click on pages so once you just do click on add new pages all you have to do is put your page title over here and just publish okay once you do that you can just view the page so this is how our page looks but we want everything blank so again let's go back again so just go back to the previous page of what you could do, do is just click on edit page once you click over here you will come over here so what you have to do is just do no sidebar so on the right hand side astra settings okay so this is nothing astra settings no sidebar and full width stretch okay and just update so now all you have to do is so once you're done with everything all you have to do is just click edit with elementor and once you do that so once we are here so this is how it looks elementor to 
all you you could do is just do like this select your structure again this is guys just like paint okay so you don't have to worry about it and there are you just click on pages there are templates as well which you could choose so again there are a lot of templates which you could choose from some are free some are paid but i would just suggest in the beginning just be free and again let's go over here okay let's put the heading you can search just put the heading over here in the middle and then again do it simple like this again ancient japanese tonic come over here ancient japanese tonic and then you can change the style make it black and then the best thing is just click over here the navigator again you can just select the section you can select the width of it and then also if you go structure or style so you can just click on section go on advance and then top something like this again just go column heading and then once you're over here if you would like to add something just click this box and let's say we are going to add an image okay then we can choose an image all you have to do is just do a snipping tool okay okay just save this okay and then just save it we just uploaded the image and the next thing which you could do is button and then just come down okay so if you want to change any of these things everything's over your button again for the button make this layout make it extra large you can change the color so let's say make it something red okay and then content you can add an icon as well so let's add this icon just for demo purposes okay there are a lot of settings which you could do but for now i'm just gonna update it and then again just take your clickbank link copy it just for demo purposes test generate hop link copy the link come over here okay and then just add the link okay and then what is the style i'll make it like this update once this is done can just refresh uh, let's open my page in incognito so this is how my page looks so there are a lot of things you can add in the page the headline the benefits the testimonials so i have exp so all these things are really important psychological factors you know this is how someone clicks on the offer page there are a lot of psychological factors like the the testimonial the reviews the benefits and the guarantee the scarcity so everything is explained in my case study the link is down below go and check it out and i think this is it for the video and if you find it really helpful please consider subscribing and yavar khan signing off